Sorry for the super slow start. I was kind of, I was eating. So, I decided to eat. But now I'm here. Oh. I cannot hear anything. But you probably can. There we go. Okay, so we're just going to do side shit. I'm not going to bother with trying to do the main quest right now. Um, just because I don't want to get caught up in the main quest when I don't know how much there might be to do. So... We can go do this quest. I thought it's always good to get out of the way once in a while anyways. Yeah. Are you sure we shouldn't be uh, checking up on you? I mean, whatever went on between you and Beta sounded intense. And not that I'm judging you. <laughs> Forge knows all the screws flew loose every time Mercer and I fought. I think we'll be fine from now on. I'm glad to hear it. Anybody take you up on that ale you brought yet? Zo can't stand the smell of it. I tried Alva, but I don't think she knows what taking a break means. And I'm not putting Varl anywhere near that stuff after that victory party in Meridian. Hi, come in. Ah, now there's a man that can hold his liquor. Pretty sure we downed half a keg. We had a good chat, I think. After we get Hephaestus, we'll be taking the fight to the Zeniths. So, no more reading. Ah, it wasn't that bad. Not really. Besides, uh, going through all that data helped me realize something. You know, the soldiers, the, the ones that fought the Pharaoh machines so Gaia could be built, uh, they were fighting a battle that couldn't be won. Not with all the weapons in the world. I think most of them realized that, whether anyone said it or not. And they still did it, though. They bought time. Comet, what are you all doing? All eggheads were going to save the future. Our future. As long as I can do that for you, I'll consider myself a success. Thank you, Errant. I'm glad you're with me. Okay, enough. I'm gonna get emotional. I should go. That yeah, same here. I got a date with a cauldron to prepare for. Aloy. Everything okay with you and Beta? It sounded like you guys had a uh, lively conversation. We can actually go try to do we some of the arena stuff to too. Talk about. Does this mean she's coming with us to Gemini? It does. I hope you're ready to rein in the most stubborn AI of all time. That's what all this was for, wasn't it? Hephaestus won't go down quietly. Hephaestus is just a program that's lost its way. We are fighting for our survival. I can always call upon the goddess if you're nervous. Funny. You were right, you know, about keeping Rost's memories buried. I might try to do most I of the side content that we can God, before me back. the he me next the mission. But the truth is, he gave me a lot. And I took him for granted. He was a good man. He raised you well. How does everyone seem to you? Comet, Anxious, what are you doing? But ready. I heard Catalo ask for Alva's help with his pulse generator. And I know he's been helping her with a few fighting techniques, just in case. I hope they aren't needed. Like I said, just in case. My leg is being really weird right now. Any last findings you want to share before leaving? Not really. Though I've reached a decision. Oh? When we put Gaia together, 
I want to return to the Nora, spread what I've learned. You think they'll listen to you? In time, I believe what are you so. Doing, comment. If anyone can make it happen, it's you, Vol. What about Zoe? What will you and Zoe do if you go back to the Embrace? I hope she'll come with me, at least for a while. And I'll go with her to Plainsong, too. She'll probably want to talk to her people about all this as well. We'll figure it out. I know you will. I hope firing off those pulse generators will be enough to Well, I mean, at least that answered the question. It'll work. It has to. Always optimistic, huh? Nah, just stubborn. It's a good quality to have when dealing with you. Yeah, right. I'm glad you're coming with me, Vol. Sure there's no urge to run off alone in there somewhere? No more running. What? Everybody wants to talk. Hey, we'll be going after Hephaestus soon. You good with the plan? I've already got the location of my assigned cauldron. Good. <clears throat> I heard you and Beta had a talk. News travels fast. It wasn't exactly a quiet conversation. There were just things that needed to be said. A healthy crop to those who clear the weeds between them, as the Utaru say. You look like you have something on your mind. We're going to war soon. And war is something Hi. I promised myself I'd left behind in the Red Raids. But the more of your data I go through, Every voice I hear, every word I read from our ancient past, it makes me realize just how much life was given so that ours could flourish. Fighting for that gift, it's our responsibility. If we fail, it was all for naught. Helps to know you're not alone. Hi, Tichil! For a moment there. We're doing side content today. Like I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, big yawn. I know. I should go. As soon as you intend to leave for Gemini, you'll hear about it. I'm just talking to people before we do it. What's on your mind? Have you spoken with Zoe at all? A little bit, but... Uh, I did hear her singing with Varl not too long ago. I don't think they noticed. So seemed so uh, free when she did it. Like every emotion she had was taking flight in what song. What are you doing? Uh, and she looked happier because of it. Uh, I felt so dull and nervous in comparison. You should ask so to teach you sometime about Utara music. Maybe. If you need anything before heading out to the cauldrons, hi. Have nothing to worry about. Guy Look at this cat. The plan in detail, oh, as expected yeah. from such an efficient AI. I've even received some very um, uh, succinct combat advice from Kotalo. You know, uh, in case the Zeniths show up. What kind of advice? He um, told me to run. <laughs> I'll leave any odds soon enough. <laughs> Anything new around here? Kotalo showed me the schematics for his new arm. I recall reading about robotic limbs within the legacy, but I never thought I'd see one in action. Technology like that would be treasured back home. Think of what it could do for injured workers or soldiers. But knowing the Imperial family, they would use it for different purposes their own replacing body parts as they grow older like the zenith exactly any more data catch your eye all of it i have so much to study up on years actually i'm particularly interested in the odyssey we knew the ancestors had made it to the moon <laughs> in fact we theorized some and got to settled. chill but sirius is way farther than that and we thought journeying across the ocean would be the feat of a lifetime. 
The sheer calculations needed for space travel. It's They're always coming up with new lines about. to get around filters. Even so, the Quen are way ahead of other tribes when it comes to understanding this stuff. Where I grew up, everyone thought that stars were sparks that rose from a fire lit by the goddess to guide us through the night. Why are you licking my head? Yes, you are. You're trying to eat my hair. Why? Why? Hi. Must be strange to think that some of the ancestors your tribe reveres are still alive. We do have the best viewers here, though. You guys are awesome. Yeah, it is. Part of me is curious to know who else besides Eric Visser might be among them. Maybe Nikita Arand? We call her the Spark. The legacy tells us she brought unlimited energy to the old ones. Or Song Zhao, whom we call the healer. It is said she found new ways to extend the ancestors' lifespans. But my curiosity fades when I think of how different our view of Visser was compared to the reality that you experienced. Perhaps it is better not to know. No man's sky weird lands on desert planet, ocean everywhere, and cannot actually land. Oh god. What was Leviathan again? A flood control system back in the Great Delta. Hi. It was built by Eileen Sasaki, another of our ancestors. If we can acquire the data on it, we might be able to fix the system back home. Then my sister, my parents, other families won't have what to are you doing? washing away when the long rains come. Right. And to find it, we need to head back to San Francisco. Thank you so much for the sub! Keep up the great work, love the stream. Thank you! I do appreciate it. And I do plan to keep up the great work. In fact, regulars... ...should check out Kitty Cares. <laughs> oh. Thank you so much, Illy. I have to go. By the way, if I ever call anybody by a name that you would rather not be called and you have something else you'd rather me call you on stream, feel free to let me know. I forgotten about the data on Leviathan. I'll let you know when I make it back to Landfall. Thank you, Aloy. Oh god, my eye is like, had shit in it or something. Ice skating. <laughs> Aloy, are you well? Thank you. Bit of an issue with I try. Aloy. I try. It's better now, though. I'm hoping to be streaming uh, full time by the end of the year. I'm not surprised. Fingers crossed. Really? Actually, I really. Every single sub right now is actually extra special because I'm so close to hitting payout for March. Deeply uncomfortable for him. So I'm Did crossing my fingers. Covered? In time. But not before the two siblings nearly killed each other in a single Cat, what are you doing? Ah. Well, at least I avoided that. You nervous about the mission ahead? If I live, it will be in victory. If Let's die, face it, this it is why you're all here. What matters most is that you achieve your objective. I'll do my best. Right. Oh, yeah. Think you're ready to put all your training to the test? I am to knock. I am always ready. I still need to fix my ears for my headset. I bet people are curious about that new arm of yours. None more than our Quen ally, I assure you. She couldn't wait to take it apart and figure out how it works. I gave her the data I used to build the thing, hoping I would satisfy her curiosity instead. Good luck with that. Okay. 
And that is that. I awesome. Okay. I await your orders. Okay. So we are Okay, I did mark that already. I don't even know if we'll do it right away. We might just dig around. We shall see. We got a lot of map to figure out still. So. Actually, you know what we haven't done at all yet? This. Where's the frost breath? I don't know why it keeps going black. Apparently this is racist. Do I still need owls? I don't think so. I think it goes. It shouldn't, though. Because that wasn't a new area load. There's an actual. There is a loading screen. Nope, I missed it. Because there is a- there's an actual loading screen. <laughs> Let me see, did I actually ne even need owls? Uh, crab, fish, salmon. I might need, okay, I, I need a duck feather and that's it. Aside from that, it's like seagulls and crabs and fishes. So I can leave the owls alone. You know what? I like cut across because I can see that they're going all the way over here. My fire raptor is going nuts, killing shit. The machine riders from before, the ones who were racing. I don't know what they're up to. I won the race. Hey, up. You threw a rock in my face. It's not like you can get any uglier. Ha ha. Riding machines, huh? Who taught you to do that? Hey, squad. 
We got someone with a death wish here. Whoa. Look at that hair. What? Someone get a little lost in the desert? Hey, hey, what's that thing the Easterners keep saying we do? <laughs> oh, yeah. We all drink blood here, right? Maybe we should drink yours. You can try. Is that a challenge? Cool your blaze, Josek. Don't think you want to test your luck with Hikaru's new champion. We have no business with you, Outlander. I think we all had our fun. Road's right over there. Those machines used to be Regalos. But you don't look like holdouts to me. Who are you? How'd you get these mounts? Around here, you want something, you race for it. You cross that finish line first, I'll answer any questions you have. Aloy, you got a mount? Race is full. Actually, I think a spot just opened up. All right. What are the rules? Don't die. Okay, then. This ought to be good. The black screen is a bug? Okay. Well, I just, I wonder whenever it happens, because sometimes it's my capture card flaking out. But usually then it's only for me. It's not for the stream, too, so. This way, fresh meat. Let's get you that mount. I see you carry a bow. Good. You'll need to use it if you want to win. Against the other racers? They will if you don't. We put everything on the line when we get on that track. Makes it worth something. You can test run the track if you want to. Just let me know when you're ready for the real thing. Let's do it. When you are. All in. See you on the other side. Oh god. Got you now. Get it up. Yeah, let's go. How did I... How do I aim backwards again?
go, go! I did it! Here. This game looks like hard work. You earned it. I am a very like active gamer, so you owe me some answers. Name's Atta. As for how we got these mounts, most of us here used to be rebels. Joined Regala's army thinking we'd get a chance to fight in a real war against the Karja. Instead, Regala slaughtered our own in cold blood, barren life. When we made it back to camp, we snuck out. Hey, you guys think that's something? Just wait until I can finally do proper VR streams. We were better off on our own. No rules, no chiefs. Just the speed of our mounts and the taste of blood. Doesn't sound too bad, I guess. Where's your quiet friend? The one with the mask? He didn't join the race. He gave up his spot so you could join. Probably for the best. What makes you say that? That one hasn't lost a single race. Uh, I've been yeah, doing, uh, when I visit Mux, I've been doing, um... You know, Hacks found a spot Skyrim VR. A race at the farthest end of Lowland territory, right by the beach. Make your way there. Maybe there'll be a spot waiting for you. If I'm in the area, I'll think about it. Essentially, I've smacked him upside the back of the head several times. Oh, hey, there's even a quest here. Okay, let's go here. Go for it, Black Hand. Uh, actually, let's check my skills first. Okay, so I've got those two both full. I think I was working on the melee one next. be good. Alright, let's do that. But to knock the settlement, might want to stop for supplies. Yeah, because we definitely have to make sure we get all of the the side shit. Arrowhand, eh? Maybe I was wrong about you. I don't need a chaplain telling me a battle. That spear is a weapon oh, is an awesome the real force. battle is arguing with you. Look, we don't get those hearts, we don't get water, and everyone dies. <sighs> I'm going back to the pens. I'll gut those machines myself. So machines did this? An Easterner with hair like blood. The outlander that took down the bulwark. You bested Regala. Killed her champion, Greta, too. Both of them were our clan. It's Aloy, and I'm not looking for any trouble. 
Well, maybe I could use some trouble right about now. Out there is a big herd my people harvest. We take the machine's hearts, send them to our capital, get paid with water. It's harder every year. Killer machines keep showing up to defend the herd. Last one hit us right as we were penning up our prey. It nearly wiped us out. But our quarry is still in the pens, which means if I can get their hearts, we can trade for the water we need. If you go out there alone, you'll probably wind up dead, Draka. I'm not going alone, Chaplain. The great champion killer is coming with me. How about you answer some questions first? What can you tell me about this herd? Been there for years. We harvest the parts we need from it. No more, no less. New machines always show up to replace our kills. What about the killer machines you mentioned? They guard the herd. The more we take out, the more arrive. First sawtooths, then ravagers. Oh boy. Now, a sandblasted thunderjaw. Hit us right as we were hurting machines. Oh, a tents. thunder jaw. Half my hundreds behind me. Oh, that's gonna suck. Only survivors are the ones you see here. You mentioned the capital gives you water. There's no giving. We pay tribute for it with machine parts. Hearts being the most valuable. Every other desert village has some resource to exchange. But the capital of Scalding Spear is the only one with a constant supply of water. Here in dry country, it's the same as holding everyone's lives in their hands. It is the way of the desert. How we've always survived. Yeah. There's like a Doesn't weird, like, like this deep almost yours? echo to his voice. Like he Survival was the recording the lines from home or something with a different mic. Plans. That means she really likes her rules and order. But you don't. I just don't like hers. This is insubordination. Well, I must be dehydrated. Whoa, yeah, because there is completely different. So you're a chaplain. That was weird. Like Decca. You've met Decca? Her blades were something to behold back when I still had a squad. Now, just like she counseled the lowlanders, I counsel the desert clan. Those who reach my age are meant to share our wisdom with the young. Keep them on the true warrior's path, and their stubbornness kicks up dust and clouds it. <laughs> You're not upset, I thought, Regala? The desert respects strength. Why shouldn't I do the same? Wouldn't expect any followers she has left to follow suit, though. I'll help you harvest those pen machines if I can. Probably better if you don't do it on your own. Seems like your village needs you right now. I like her. An outlander after my own heart. We can leave now, or I can meet you at our outpost southeast. Yes, he recorded in like two different places with two different mics. I have something to take care of first. You go on ahead. I'll wait at the outpost for as long as I can. May the ten protect you then. That's so weird. I'll await your return and report to the capital. Yeah, you do that. Or maybe let's like two different people, but it sounds weird. Machine strike. You know what? We haven't played machine strike in a while. Let's do it. If you think you've got what it takes to beat me at strike, step right up. This guy's intermediate. Let's see if we can do it. Okay, so I see a lot of jungle and planes. That's weird. So my sets keep disappearing. Okay. So. That could actually be pretty badass. Hmm. 
Let's go instead with... Let's try that. Let's see what you're made of. Kick his butt. My turn. Your move. Don't think I want to do it while he's up there, though. Ring that guy up. Him over there. What will I do? Ow! Oh shit. A commendable move. Another piece off the board. There we go. One down. Machine's done. And off the board you go. There we go. Guess we're putting that piece away. Really? Only minus one? Oh, because it's a strong point. I get it. What to do now? Your turn. That was an honorable winner. For there we go. I did it. I 
I feel like that set actually worked pretty well. Attacking hits your target and any mi machines perpendicular to it. So be side beside it. So in other words, I gotta keep my machine spread out. The board's set. All yours. Right, I'm up. Go ahead. My turn. I'm waiting for him to like actually move forward. There we go. You're up. And off the board you go. There we go. move. A solid move. I might have to rethink things here. Oh, wait. What to do now? down another piece off the board. damn he just took out my stalker that machine's done What will I do? Go ahead. Him there, and let's bring him over here. All right, I'm up. You're up.
My turn. All yours. That's all right. I can handle it. Well played. There we go. Got him. Yes. Boom. The set's actually working well against him. Let's begin. What will I do? Your turn. Put that there. What to do now? Go ahead. Right, I'm up. Guess we're putting that piece away. Okay, here we go. Another piece off the board. was unexpected. He did not like my piece. Your move. down. Okay, so that'll go down to two, whereas this one would go to two as well. My turn. Your turn. Off the board you go. There we go. That'll get it. Looks like I lose. Yes! Enjoy your well I did it! I beat an intermediate! All boards! Oh wait, no, that was the same board. Fuck! Okay, hang on, wait. One more board. That was the first board. Okay, one more.
So he's the only one that really has much of a skill. I think I'm going to try the same set again. May the best player win. I'm up. That machine's done. Ouch. There we go. So I can take out his breast yes, putting that piece away. Right away. that piece right where I wanted it. Guess we're Ouch. putting that piece away. That machine's done. What to do now? All yours. I'll admit it. You know what you're doing. Hang on, what are the other two here? Claw Strider doesn't really have anything. Maybe there's a thing here. But this one's worth four. If he takes this one, then I lose. What will I so do? I have to be careful. Another piece off the board. That was your piece off the board. That's a win. And the last Yes! Of the there we go. I got it. Prize. I get it. Seats always open for you. There we go. The board is set up if anyone's willing to step up for a game of strike. Okay. Why? Because I'm jumping around? Good food. Meh. Well, I do my best to keep customers happy. Okay. That guy's very demanding.
What do I need to kill on this thing? I know I need to kill something. Okay, so those thingies on his face. Um. So pretty much just those thingies on his face. I'll keep some extra on hand. Let's do it, let's do it! No, let me see your other side, damn it. We go, got it. Got it! Yes! I make this thing angry. Here, Robo Kitty, Kitty, Kitty.
Whoops. There we go. There's no more fire. Oh god. Okay, screw this. There we go. Okay. God fucking damn it, stop. There it goes, it's gonna boom, it's gonna boom! It's gonna blow! Kaboom! Nope, it didn't boom, that's okay. I almost boomed. I need it. Okay. I need food. Rather gross berries. I swear I blew even more of those things off. Maybe they went away because I didn't loot them fast enough. That's kind of bullshit.
I got the behemoth thing though, so that should hopefully help. Because I'm pretty sure that's what I'm going to need eventually to tame one. Here to help me hunt down those machines, I hope. Oh, you came. You mean the ones I already killed? You'll have to excuse the mess. Our soldiers use this place to prepare themselves before herding machines into the canyon and harvesting parts. Feel free to take any supplies you need. Our prey isn't far. I'm right behind you. This way. Sooner we get those machine hearts, faster we'll get the water we need. Whoa! I can't believe an outlander would lend us a hand when our own clan won't. Our so-called commander's always talking about how scarce water is in the desert. But do you really think the dying of thirst? Or her own squad? Our clan should be led by someone who knows what it's like to fight tooth and nail to survive. And I'm guessing that someone is you? I'd make sure everyone gets all the water they need. No matter what village they're from. Didn't Jataka say you guys have too little to go around to begin with? I'm sure I'd be able to fix that somehow. There's always a way. Look at this little lizard. There he is. detail in those scales like that's insane like keep in mind okay so that's how detailed that is but hang on just you wait That's how big the model itself is. <laughs> you know what? Let's get a selfie of Aloy with the lizard. Like, that's some insane textures. Cause like from this distance, it looks photorealistic on the lizard. Like that is insane. Let's have a word before we head in. 
All right. came back. I'm honored. I'll help you harvest machine hearts if it'll get water for your people. Oh, it will. That's the canyon we draw machines into. Then we block them in and pick them off. Now, we'll have to climb over the barricade to get in. When we do, be ready to fight. I already lost good people in there. Can't wait to see the champion killer in action. You go and I'll follow. Whoa, what time are we at? Strong against frost ammo. Not what I intended to do. This is what I wanted to do. Either native 4K or downscale, depending on which mode. Well, yeah, and I, we're doing, um... We're doing... We're in... Like, pretty mode, right? Because I'm only in 1080p anyways, right? So... Or wait, no, we're in performance, I think? Is that what we went with, is performance? Because I don't even have a, um... A 4K TV. You're curious as to how the screenshots come out? I'll post them, uh, eventually. Well, yeah, because the stream is only at 1080, right? Or, sorry, the stream is at 720.
There we go. Yeah, because that's the one thing. It's like, as pretty as it is for you guys, I'm playing on a giant-ass 1080p TV, so... What was that? I'll save the extra stock for later. It's like, where did he go? Where the hell's the other Fanghorn? Well, I don't know, but there's treasure up here. It will be nice when I can eventually do 1080, 60 frames. But, one reason that I do stick with 720 is actually just because of the, um, there it is. Is so that if people aren't on as good of internet, it's that it doesn't, I should take these you know, you guys them. don't have problems. Oh. <sighs> May the wings of the ten carry you home, my brother. I got the hearts. We should head back to Arrowhand. Yeah. Place now we can bag and tag these soldiers. Oh, hold on. Since you can clearly handle a bunch of angry machines, I want to go back to where the Thunderjaw hit us. I lost a lot more fighters there. I can't just leave them to rot. They deserve to be bagged and tagged, too. Will you come with me? Lead the way. Glad to have you along. Well, we're going after a Thunderjaw. Oh, wait, I need Thunderjaw tails. Dude, just jump. That was some weird ass climbing, dude. To think so many have to die just to get water. That was Did so awkward to watch, I know. <laughs> oh, please, the only thing she'll listen to is the sound of a bow being drawn. About that. Wouldn't mind having yours at my side if it ever came to it. I'm just passing through, Draka. Uh, can't blame me for trying. This is it, where the Thunderjaw ripped through my squad. I'm sorry, Draka. They were warriors to the end. We should get started. There's this whole area up here, too. Someone's alive, by the rocks. Shine. What I go for a cool place.
Speak sense, soldier. Burrowers. To battle! Fair. Thunderjaw's back. This is gonna get rough. Dude. There we go, I got his tail. Ravagers around. We can use their cannons. Go get one. I'll draw the Thunderjaw's fire. Give you some room. Come on. You said you were going to draw his fire. Oh God, I'm not giving up.
Well, this will do. I should check on Draka and that soldier. Yes, I need the gross berries. Save these for when I need it. Man. Didn't think I was going to make Whew. it. You did good, soldier. You're going back home. Thanks to this one. You were the one who refused to leave your people behind. Uh, I know I'm racking up favors here, but uh, did you take those hearts back to Arrowhand? We'll be right behind you. Of course. Be careful. With that Thunderjaw heart in hand, we'll get all the water we need. Thank you, Aloy. Even though I could fast travel, running back will let me get gross berries, so... Just in case anybody forgets why I call them gross berries, it is because in the like tutorial, she eats one and she makes like a gross face. Hence, gross berries. Tired though. What the fuck was that? You're no Greetings, warrior. Appreciate the extra pair of hands, Chuck. <laughs> You've returned. Where's Draka? Just a little late, Chaplain. Gained some extra baggage on the way back. She's got the machine hearts, including a Thunder Jaws. You should have seen this flame in the desert. Here. Something to commemorate our heroic victory. A victory indeed. Command will be relieved to hear about this. Get them to scald he sounds familiar. And tell the commander. I swear he sounds like guy. somebody from Star Trek occasionally. Huntress, may I have a word? Tuvok, that's it. The grove. They say that in addition to your bow and spear, you have a kind of second sight. Okay, you have to look that up, Max. To do with the old ones. Jataka is his point. name. So it's true. You've done well by my clan. But our troubles may not be as easily settled as Draka believes. 
I think your second sight might be just what we need. What exactly it is, is him? The problem? <laughs> Not here. Meet me at Scalding Spear. I'll explain everything. I'll see you there when I can. Good. The entire <gasps> clan might depend on it. Oh my gosh. Like, the way that the lighting in this is, like, insane. Like, especially, like, looking in here from, like, out here. They're like, god damn. I wanted to go down here, though. I want to see what's up here, and then I will probably stop for the night. I thought it was. I still feel like, um, Stemmer sounds familiar too, but I think it's just because they just gave him, like, the stereotypical so, country slash western storyteller huh? voice. Uh, yeah. And this heat. Oh, yeah, this heat. It's really hot. Oh, she came here. Steel flame. Look what the desert wind blew in. I'm standing right here, Porgy. Stop calling me that. You used to love that name. Porgy's lucky I came out west. This place needs a lot of work. <laughs> you should have seen when we first got here. It was just a puddle in the sand. Well, this ain't much of an improvement. You really set things right around here, Steel Flame. For the Dell and with my sister. Thanks. Thank you, Aloy. Steel flame! Look what the desert wind blew in! It says I'm that he's got right things here, to say, Porgy. but... Stop. Okay, so we're going west. You used to love that. No, east. <laughs> Whoops. It's actually really interesting when you think about it that, like, there's so many... I don't even necessarily want to say big names, but... Like, it's, it seems like a lot of people are switching to, like... You know. I don't know for sure if it was ever, like, taboo, but it seems to be a lot more common now for people to do video games instead of more TV and stuff. Vines are clearing up. Probably taboo, so to speak, just because for the longest time nobody took video games as serious medium for storytelling. Yeah, I could see it. I'm like, I mean, I guess the bigger the stories got, the more they wanted actual... Like, people with actual talent for the voice acting, you know? I'm gonna go in here. I know I should go to sleep, but... I wanna go in here first. We might not do whatever's in here if there is anything in here. But 
know there's still some good actors sometimes involved, but usually seem to deal with live action clips for games like Red Alert. Mark Hamill was in basically everything. <laughs> people that do it see it as like a good thing and not as a oh god I'm like stuck in vi stuck with doing video games kind of thing you know because like it's it's one of those things too where like TJ Thine was like perfect for Moreland like absolutely perfect Seeing a whole lot else in here, though. It'll probably depend on the part they had. You assume, like, Christopher Judge largely enjoys playing Kratos? Well, no, that's what I mean. It's like, I'm not expecting everybody, but... I mean, for all we know, too, is, like, people like, um, Tuvok and, or whatever his name is, and Tim Russ and, uh, TJ Titan and stuff, for all we know, they're actually fans of the first game, and they requested to be in this. This looks like it goes into No Man's Land. Can I go off the map over here? There's no map over here. There's a lot of owls, though. For a spot that's not on the map, this place is, like, fully fleshed out. With a lot of owls. Looks like there's not- I just want to check out this area here, but it looks like there's not a whole lot here. be that stuff I, I like people involved in sci-fi have it easier in voice acting rather than live action anymore well i mean tj thine was in bones so that's not exactly sci-fi I think it spotted me. Run away!
Oh god, I made them angry! God, just give me this treasure, and we'll get the fuck out of here. I'm done. Okay. There we go. I don't know if I want to bother going back. Screw it, I can go get the treasure. Oh, hopefully there's no more angry ones. Just because I might need the wing burners later. Mainly speaking for the people you know. Like I said, I wouldn't be shocked if some of it is also, like, by request, you know? You know, like, they're huge fans of the, sh the series, so... I think that's it. All right, guys. Um, I'm gonna call it a night there. I'm gonna go to this campfire. So just so that we can do a hard save, just because we keep getting. I mean. Not even a quick save would work, but I want to make sure we actually save, just because... I keep getting, um... Like, they, if they do an update, then we're gonna lose shit, so... Alright guys, thank you so much for hanging out. I'm gonna head to bed. Um, I'm gonna try and be live tomorrow. But I do have to uh, load up my car. Um, 
So I might be a little later than normal, but I'm going to try to be live tomorrow. Um, and then just a reminder that on Wednesday, I'm actually heading down to CMOX. So, uh, yeah, uh, we're going to try and do some stuff for Mux on Wednesday. Uh, when we go, though, uh, probably some Skyrim VR. Um, maybe some couch co-op stuff if I can convince him. Not guaranteeing a camera, but... Um, uh, yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for hanging out. We'll see you guys all tomorrow, if I am around tomorrow. If not, I will see you when I'm back. Uh, until then, everybody have a great night. Bye, everybody.